Tonight we want to tell you about a new series we're beginning called Alabama Champions. It's highlighting people who make a difference right where they live. Not much happens these days at the old Powderly Elementary School. It's been closed since 2011, but a group of Powderly alums have been quite busy, inspired by the connections they made all the way back when they were in school. Now they're on a mission to help revitalize the community. ABC 3340's Ariel Clay explains. Okay, so this was the lunchroom here? We had the best cinnamon rolls. It's been decades since this group of men attended class at Powderly Elementary School. So it's kind of surprising just how vivid their memories of the place still are. This is Miss Austin's class. And what did she yeah. teach? She taught music. Powderly was special to them. That's why they remember. And that's why almost 55 years later, they've band together to create the men of Powderly. Yeah, I had gone to about six funerals and I called Lavin and I told him, I said, we need to start seeing each other and stop viewing one another so much. It started with a small reunion at a local restaurant, but the men figured, why not do more? What can we do to revitalize? What can we do to, to bring back the community that has given us so much? In the years since they left Powderly, things haven't gone great for the community. The men think they can help change that. They've hosted clothing and food drives, had a toy giveaway, and one of their favorite events, a Valentine's Day dance for seniors. Do little things to try to bring a sense of pride back into the neighborhood. They've also spearheaded cleanup efforts and although many have moved away from the neighborhood. So by a show of hands, how many of you still live in Powderly? Just one of you. One long-term goal is to improve housing. Bringing in uh, quality homes for families. Uh, most of us have moved out, but we still have that passion for the community because this is where uh, we grew up. And where their hearts will remain. In Birmingham, Ariel Clay, ABC 3340 News.